So, um, this is a really random decision to suddenly start to make a video. So, I didn't really thought about anything I was going to say in this video, and there is literally no point to this whole video because I haven't even thought about filming a video before the thought of dyeing my hair popped up in my head almost three minutes ago. As you can see, my hair is now basically kind of colourless. I have the most terrible grow out, which doesn't really look like a grow out, to be honest, which is good because then I can just dye over me and I don't have to bleach it or anything because my hair is kind of like death at the moment. What a surprise if you bleach your hair every three months or so. I mean, that's not really healthy for your hair, is it? But, well, randomly I decided I really wanted to dye my hair again. I haven't searched up any reference photos at all. I just thought, well, let's go into my hair dye drawer and let's see if there's anything I want to put in my hair today. <sighs> Impulsive decisions. So I have a couple of options right here and I'm not so sure which one I'm going to choose. First of all I got blue. I mixed this a really long time ago. I uh, haven't used it. I believe I actually mixed it to be uh, purple but then it turned out to be blue because I put in too much blue. So I didn't use it anymore. But I also have violet and lilac here. Um, just two crazy colours. Haven't used this one. Have used this one. Um, then I got two others and I believe these are from Swartzkopf. How do you pronounce that brand name in English? It's just impossible. I believe this is the purple one and this is the pink one. I threw away the original packaging but yeah I still have these. Pink could be interesting as well with a mix of purple. And then I got two La Richa Directions and they these two <laughs> yes these two look absolutely similar to each other I mean do you even see a difference I don't really do um but this is violet and this is silver it looks straight up freaking violet blue in the in pot but yeah it says to be silver I don't think silver is going to pick on my hair at this point because it's not bleached. It is kind of blonde in the ends because I did bleach it before, but I don't think it's light enough. I'm not so sure. I'm, I'm not a hairdresser at all. If my hairdresser will see this video, she will cry. <laughs> now, I asked my boyfriend which colour he would choose and he said he'd do purple instead of blue. Mm. That was the wrong bottle. So I've got two bottles of water and this is a fresh one that I just got myself. This one has been standing here for two weeks or so. So there is like no bubbles in here anymore. But this one has. But I picked the wrong one because I keep half empty bottles in my room for weeks. I've got an empty one as well and another empty one. It's a collection. Well, before I'm gonna put anything in my hair, I have to wash it because it's absolutely the worst. Because it's really oily. I am quite sure you can see on camera that it's pretty greasy at the moment because um, yesterday I went to the gym but I didn't feel like washing my hair when I came back. I know that's really gross but I was lazy and just wanted to go to bed. So that's what I did and I haven't done anything with my hair ever since. So now it's greasy as hell. So I have to do that first. Then I probably have to walk the dog and then I am able to dye my hair. I don't know if I picked the exactly the best time to dye my hair, but I'm impulsive and I'm a teenager and I just want to do this. This one looks so blue. This can't be violet. This is just straight up blue. This is not lilac. I have the slight feeling that this is going to be the biggest disaster in my life. And this is also going to be the second video in which I'm going to dye my hair. And I knew what a struggle it was the previous time because I had to set up my mirror and just didn't work because uh, like whenever I'm going to dye my hair I seem to be blind so I have to have a huge mirror to look in otherwise it's just not gonna work so this is gonna be a absolute torture oh that was very charming oh wait I would die to have hair like this like literally so cool I would want to have a perm and then dye it ginger because that would be the most amazing thing ever but I think that will severely damage my hair since my hair is already <laughs> pretty damaged Good idea to dye it then. Actually thinking about the stuff I do is not really my biggest talent, to be honest. I'd rather be impulsive and just do things without thinking about it at all. 
which is not completely true though because sometimes I overthink things way too much but the things you should overthink about I do not overthink about and I do impulsively and then regret it afterwards because it's absolutely shit but on the other hand, what would I care? Meanwhile, I finally washed my hair. Step two is gonna be blow drying it because obviously it needs to be dry to be able to dye it. I hate blow drying my hair because one, I hate heat. So this is gonna be the most torturing experience I've ever did because I never blow dry my hair because of it. And also it's just, ugh, my hair gets so poofy and all over the place when I blow dry it. I'll have to because otherwise I have to wait like an hour and I can't do that because I mean, the schedule doesn't allow. Oh boy. All right, there we go. Okay, so now my hair's blow dried. We can start to mix the hair dye. I'm still not really sure what I want to do. So this is gonna be very difficult. Probably going for purple since I have so much purple. But which purple am I going to use? That's the question. Because I have a million different kinds of purple. This looks pretty cool. Yeah, I'm gonna put violet in my hair. I'm gonna put a bit of the lilac that I still have because there's not so much in here anymore. So I'm just gonna mix that together. Maybe we're gonna put a bit of pink in there as well. This is the pink color. And I'm going to put a bit of violet in there as well, the blue violet. I once put it in my hair with the intention of dyeing my hair purple and it indeed turned out to become absolutely blue. Just not fun if your intention was to make it purple. I think I have more than enough right now so I'm going to put it in my hair. Oh this is going to be so exciting. Okay. Yeah, I have a Winnie the Pooh blanket, no shame, you know? Good morning, it's next morning. Hello, there's my hair. Oh, okay. I just came out of bed, so I'm gonna get ready for today. I look like a piece of shit. I don't wanna see that. So I'm gonna put some makeup on and I'm going to do my hair decently because this is, uh, my camera just stopped filming out of nowhere. I don't know why. I'm going to, <coughs> what's my voice doing? I'm going to make myself beautiful again. Whoa, my eyes look so blue in combination with this hair. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> well, anyway, I'm gonna set you guys on a tripod and I'm gonna try to make myself look a little bit better. Mm. <laughs> this is absolutely a bad idea because I put my tripod on my bed. So this is not stable. Yes. I have clothes on that are decent enough for the day. So now I'm gonna fix this mess on my head because yes, it doesn't look like anything at the moment, but like a hell of a bird nest. Okay, I did my makeup, it's done. I'm not so sure what I wanna do in my hair though because <sighs> it's a bit poofy. I don't know, maybe I just put it up. God, I'm not good at doing hair though. That might be very clear at this point. <laughs> Dunno. No. Okay, I'm just gonna put it in a bun because I don't know what to do. <laughs> Alright! I think this is the final hairdo I'm gonna go with. Might be a little bit more messy. I guess this is it. 
it. This is the hair dye video. That wasn't really a hair dye video, but more like me being all over the place. I hope you still enjoyed it. It was fun to make and it's fun to watch these kind of videos back when I'm older and stuff. And I'm like, oh, darling, why do you do this stuff to yourself? This is the video. I hope you enjoyed and I hope I see you back at a new one. And subscribe to my channel, give a thumbs up and see you later.